want to know the best tips for staying healthy during cold and flu season. Stick around to find out how you can keep those pesky bugs at bay. Before we get started, don't forget to like, subscribe or comment below. We'd love to hear your thoughts and tips too. Welcome to our video on staying healthy during cold and flu season. In this video, we'll cover some essential tips to help you stay well. We'll talk about diet hygiene and some handy habits to adopt. We'll also discuss the importance of boosting your immune system. This is crucial for fighting off colds and flu. Plus, we'll give you some practical advice on what to do if you start feeling under the weather. So grab a cuppa, get comfy, and let's get into it. We've got a lot to cover to ensure you stay fit and healthy through the colder months. Cold and flu season is a time when many of us feel a bit under the weather. The first thing to remember is that prevention is key. One of the best ways to avoid getting sick is to keep your immune system strong. A healthy diet is essential for a robust immune system. Eat plenty of fruits and vegetables. They are packed with vitamins and antioxidants that help fight off infections. Don't forget about protein. Foods like chicken, fish, beans and nuts are great sources. They help build and repair tissues, keeping your body strong. Staying hydrated is also crucial. Drink plenty of water throughout the day. It helps flush out toxins and keeps your body functioning properly. Another important factor is sleep. Make sure you're getting enough rest. Aim for seven to nine hours of sleep every night. Exercise is also vital. Regular physical activity can boost your immune system. It doesn't have to be intense. Even a brisk walk can make a difference. Now, let's talk about hygiene. Washing your hands regularly is one of the best ways to prevent the spread of germs. Use soap and water and scrub for at least 20 seconds. Hand sanitizer can be useful too. Keep a small bottle with you when you're out and about. It's a handy way to clean your hands when you can't get to a sink. Cover your mouth and nose when you cough or sneeze. Use a tissue or your elbow to prevent spreading germs to others. And make sure to dispose of tissues properly. Avoid touching your face, especially your eyes, nose and mouth. Germs can easily enter your body this way. Be mindful and try to keep your hands away from your face. If you start feeling unwell, it's important to take action quickly. Rest is crucial. Give your body time to heal and recover. Stay at home if you're not feeling well. This helps prevent spreading the illness to others. Plus, it gives you a better chance to recover faster. Hydration is key when you're feeling under the weather. Drink lots of fluids, like water, herbal teas and broths. They can help soothe your throat and keep you hydrated. Over the counter medicines can also help. Paracetamol and ibuprofen can reduce fever and relieve aches and pains. Always follow the instructions on the packet. Using a humidifier can keep the air moist. This can help ease congestion and make breathing more comfortable. It's especially useful during the colder months when the air tends to be dry. Natural remedies can also be beneficial. Honey and lemon in hot water can soothe a sore throat. Ginger tea can help with nausea and boost your immune system. Don't forget to take care of your mental health too. Stress can weaken your immune system. Take time to relax and unwind, whether it's through reading, meditation, or a hobby you enjoy. It's also a good idea to keep your home clean. Regularly disinfect surfaces like doorknobs, light switches, and countertops. Germs can linger on these surfaces, making it easier to get sick. Finally, consider getting a flu jab. It's one of the best ways to protect yourself from the flu. Speak to your jeep or pharmacist about getting vaccinated. So, there you have it. Some top tips to help you stay healthy during cold and flu season. Remember, a few simple habits can make a big difference in keeping those nasty bugs at bay. Stay healthy, everyone! Now, let's look at some steps you can take to stay healthy during cold and flu season. 
These simple actions can make a big difference in keeping you and your loved ones well. First, stock up on essential supplies. Make sure you have a good supply of tissues, hand sanitizer, and disinfectant wipes. Having these items on hand will help you deal with germs effectively. Next, create a daily routine that includes good hygiene practices. Wash your hands regularly, especially after being in public places. Make it a habit to clean frequently touched surfaces in your home. Boost your diet with immune-boosting foods. Incorporate plenty of fruits and vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains. This will give your body the nutrients it needs to fight off infections. Stay hydrated throughout the day. Drink plenty of water and consider adding herbal teas to your routine. Staying hydrated helps your body function at its best and can prevent dehydration. Make sure to get enough sleep each night. Aim for seven to nine hours of quality sleep. Good rest is crucial for maintaining a strong immune system. Incorporate regular exercise into your routine. Physical activity can boost your immunity and improve your overall health. You don't need to hit the gym. Even a daily walk can be beneficial. If you start to feel unwell, act quickly. Rest, hydrate, and consider using over-the-counter medicines to manage symptoms. The sooner you take care of yourself, the better your chances of a quick recovery. Finally, consider getting the flu jab. It's one of the most effective ways to protect yourself from the flu. Speak to your GP or pharmacist about getting vaccinated. Before we move on to the rest of the video, if you are finding this helpful, please like, subscribe and comment, as it really helps this video reach a wider audience. Here is a case study related to stay healthy during cold and flu season. Meet Sarah a teacher from Manchester who successfully managed to stay healthy during the cold and flu season last year. Sarah started by making sure she was eating a balanced diet rich in vitamins and minerals. She incorporated more fruits, vegetables and lean proteins into her meals. She also made it a habit to carry hand sanitizer and use it frequently, especially after handling books and materials in her classroom. Now, Let's talk about some actionable advice you can follow. First, prioritize your diet. Eat a variety of fruits and vegetables to get a good mix of vitamins and minerals. Include proteins like chicken, fish and beans to help your body repair and grow stronger. Second, make sure you are practicing good hygiene. Wash your hands regularly with soap and water and keep hand sanitizer handy. Disinfect surfaces in your home and workplace frequently. If you start to feel unwell, rest and hydrate to give your body the best chance to recover quickly. If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe. It really helps us reach a wider audience and we would greatly appreciate it. Stay healthy, everyone!